Welcome to today's class on functional analysis. Today we discuss condition for quotient space to become a Banach space. So we state the theorem. Let x be a normed space and y be a closed subspace of x. Then X is a Banach space if and only if y and x over y are Banach spaces in the induced norm and quotient norm respectively. So we prove this theorem. Proof. Let x be a Banach space. Then y is a Banach space since since y is closed in x. Now to show that x over y is a Banach space. Consider a sequence xn plus y in x over y such that it is absolutely summable. That is Sigma n equal to 1 to infinity quotient norm of xn plus y is less than infinity. Now, since quotient norm of xn plus y is equal to infimum of norm xn plus y such that y belongs to y we have norm of xn plus yn is less than or equal to quotient norm of xn plus y plus 1 by n square for n equal to 1 2 etc then Sigma n equal to 1 to infinity norm of xn plus yn is less than infinity. This is because sigma n equal to 1 to infinity quotient norm of xn plus y is less than infinity and sigma n equal to 1 to infinity 1 by n square is also less than infinity. Therefore, xn plus yn is absolutely summable. Now, since x is a Banach space by 8.1, xn plus yn is summable. That is, sigma n equal to 1 to infinity, xn plus yn equal to s belongs to x. Now, for m equal to 1, 2, etc. Norm of quotient norm of sigma n equal to 1 to m xn plus y minus s plus y that is equal to quotient norm of sigma n equal to 1 to m xn plus yn minus s plus y this is because yn belongs to y so this is less than or equal to norm of sigma n equal to 1 to m 
xn plus yn minus s by definition of quotient norm. Therefore, sigma n equal to 1 to infinity xn plus y equal to s plus y and this belongs to x over y that is a very absolutely summable series is summable in x over y therefore x over y is a Banach space Conversely, assume that y and x over y are Banach spaces. Consider Cauchy sequence xn in x. Now, since quotient norm of xn plus y minus xm plus y this is equal to quotient norm of xn minus xm plus y and that is less than or equal to norm of xn minus xm by definition of quotient norm is true for n equal to 1 2 etc and m equal to 1 2 etc and since xn is a Cauchy sequence we have sequence xn plus y is a Cauchy sequence we see that xn plus y is a Cauchy sequence in x over y. So let xn plus y converges to x plus y in x over y by 5.2 b there is a sequence y n in y such that x n plus y n converges to x in x now since yn minus ym this is equal to yn plus xn minus x minus xn plus xm minus xm minus ym plus x this is equal to yn plus xn minus x minus xn minus xm minus xm plus ym minus x So this implies norm of yn minus ym is less than or equal to norm of yn plus xn minus x plus norm of 
xn minus xm plus norm of xm plus ym minus x. Now xn plus ym converges to x, xm plus ym converges to x and xn is a Cauchy sequence. Therefore, ym from this we are getting that ym is a Cauchy sequence. A sequence yn is a Cauchy sequence in y. And y is Banach. So let yn converges to y in y. Then xn equal to xn plus yn minus yn and this converges to x minus y because xn plus yn converges to x and yn converges to y in x. Therefore, xn converges in x. Therefore, x is a Banach space. That's all for today. Have a nice day.